guys, this is Jesse with Millie, and I'm gonna show you a cool workout. I'm gonna teach some concepts that are from my book, Enlightened Dog Training. We got this long line that we're gonna use to just casually walk to the park. I don't know if you find this, but when you walk your dog and you leave the house, they are tugging and they are pulling. So what we're gonna do is work with, we're not gonna fight that. We're gonna work on leash walking on the way home. We're gonna Let's walk casually and see what kind of connection we've got. We don't even need to talk to her. And that, my friends, is the loose leash guarantee from the Holy Cycle. Beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay, so say that again. What? Just your observation. Uh, Just tell me your observation. So, Millie will not go ahead and pull when she has this long leash. Exactly. That's and she ex keeps looking back. Exactly. Now, why is that? I'll explain. A lot of dogs react to the tension in the leash, but when you give them 8 feet, 10 feet, 15 feet, and you just let them go, and you use your recall yeah. to bring them back in. I don't even need to bring them back in. Exactly. So the point here is they're always with you and connected to you because they're a pack animal. And sometimes they just want to sniff something. You can keep walking. Oh, I love this. Yeah. Can I just do this? You can just do this. Exactly. You can just do this. And while we're walking, let's practice. Let's just practice saying stop. Let's okay. practice saying sit. Nice. Good girl. Have her sit. Right back in the pocket like we like her. And reinforce that with, a, with one of your treats. And a praise and a touch. That's great. Don't react to the jumping. We don't care. This is the beginning of the workout. We're just building connection. And see, just keep walking. Just keep walking. Just keep walking. There you go. Praise her when she comes in. Good girl. Nice. This is, this is how we walk to the park, guys. Why don't you call her back to you, get her in the pocket, and praise her. Really? Nice. Good girl. Nice. Sometimes when you trust, when you offer the trust, they step up. Actually, they always do. All right, so this is our camp. We're setting up camp in the shade. We drop that leash, and we're going to go right into some wind sprint gym class. So take her head down uh, about 20 steps that way. Don't even touch the leash. We don't care. We're only going to step on that leash if it's a, if it's a, a liability, okay? And, and I'm going to call her first. Millie, come. Yes. Come here, baby. Now you call her. Millie. Praise. Good girl. Okay, give her your back and move somewhere new. Millie. Guys, when the recall isn't working, you say the name one time, give it some space, sing the name, sing the name, okay? Millie. Good girl. Good girl. Sing the name. Praise. Yes. All right, so we're going to do this until she quits. Five. Oh, come on, let's do some gym class, Millie. Come on, Millie. Ooh, 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 ooh. You want that? You want that? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. for her first day. I'm watching her out of my peripheral, which is an alpha posture. It's powerful. I'm not standing over top, which would be 
projecting I don't trust her. And I'm waiting for her to show me that she's about to come off. Then I'm going to go into the forbidden angle and show her I don't trust her to recorrect. Ah! Place. So that's your threshold. And come! And that just reinforces you come off when I tell you, baby. More gym class. More gym class, baby! Wow! Get that sucker! When I put her on the place, you might notice I move and pull her over top. Sit. Let's have a sit. Down. How do you do? She's holding your hand. How do you do? Stay. If you catch the first test and you catch it swiftly, they understand the rule. As I move, this is my angle of my eyes. It's showing I'm supervising and that is important. I'm coming up to, uh, I want to see if she's going to Good. That's the forbidden angle. It creates pressure for the retreat, okay? Her body's shaking. That's a lot of breathing. And we're using this to bring her back into calmness. Why am I doing this? If you have a reactive dog, what they're reacting to is heightened emotional state in the body. So this is building, come, good, break. Putting them in the place when they're breathing is basically teaching them self-discipline. It's gonna transfer over so that they can handle the high emotional stress moments with grace. I think that could be a wrap for today. Okay, so gym. Okay, guys, so gym class is over, and we got that rapid breathing that I always talk about. Nice correction. You didn't have to do anything other than apply that pressure on that forbidden angle, and she went right back into a sit. So we're gonna hold this, just by keeping clo be, be close to her. Don't talk to her. Don't touch her. And we want her to fully go through stage three of sequence of surrendering, which would be putting the belly down. Put pressure on her with the angle. Uh, yeah, oh. step into her. That's it, and eye contact. That's all you need to do. That's perfect. That's a perfect pivot out of eye contact at the right moment. We're just gonna marinate here. We're gonna marinate here for one to five minutes and she's gonna get bored. She's gonna put her belly down. Her breath rate's gonna calm back down and then we're gonna have a beautiful loose leash walk home. This is excellent. There's nothing fancy that we're doing now, but this is hard for most people to stay focused and calm this long. Got a dog right there. That's very good. Too much fishing. Yeah, don't go that far. That's it. Let her, we want her to strike at it, and then, then you create the tension once she's bitten it. <laughs> there you go. Start to pull it in with your hand, slowly. Pull, pull the rope in with your hand slowly. Yeah, growl. Oh. <laughs> okay. Growl. Growl at her. Wah. Wah. That's it. Oh, yeah. Good, 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 good. Wah. Now get a little tension in it. Try to match the tension when she's pulling back. Yes. Well, she's kind of, she's trying to, there you go. That's it. There you go. Now you got her. Now you got her. Too fast, too fast. Slow it down, that's it. That's perfect, that's perfect. Growl, growl at her. <laughs> Come on, there you go. Correct, correct. One step in with eye contact, we'll push her into a sit. Okay, that's all we need. And you can pivot into a calming signal, perfect.
if her breathing is really kind of still, let's release her and let's walk her home because she may just not lie down on this first try. Big, big treat, big praise. All right, so let's leash her up on that six foot leash and we'll walk her home and just see what that walk feels like. Okay, and here you have it. Another successful loose leash guarantee with the Peaceful Alpha.